Deputy Lidl Weber of the Hughes County Sheriff's Office lost his life after saving his son. Weber jumped into the Missouri River on July 3rd after his eight-year-old son fell from a moving boat. Kelloland News intern Carter Schmidt takes us to Florida to explain how an 11-year-old is honoring Weber. Tonight we introduce you to 11-year-old Zachariah Cartledge. He is the founder of Running for Heroes Incorporated, a nonprofit organization he started when he was only 10 years old. It is based in Winter Springs, Florida, northeast of Orlando. Zachariah honors people around the nation, including Deputy Weber, by running. At the age of seven, Zachariah began competing in various 5K events, including the Tunnel to Towers 5K in Orlando. That run sparked the idea for Running for Heroes. He has run 540 miles since starting the organization, a figure which includes one mile each for law enforcement officers, firefighters, and Border Patrol agents who have lost their lives in the line of duty in the last year and a half. Every single time I have a new run to do, I always get upset with that because I know that that's another community that's grieving through a loss of somebody. So yeah, I don't like to run in those situations. Families of the fallen receive a flag Zachariah had with him as he ran. Every run is broadcast on Facebook Live and the flag is mailed to a family or department. And tonight I'm running for Chief Deputy Lee R. Weber. He looked at the Hughes County Sheriff's Office in South Dakota and his end of watch is July 3rd, 2020. And normally, uh, police and fire funerals are a, a large scale event attended by hundreds, if not thousands of people, and that couldn't happen during COVID. Um, yet, Zechariah was out there running, and in some cases, that was the only memorial that some of these folks were able to have. Zechariah's message has been heard around the country, including here in South Dakota. It's amazing how all these people are learning about these fallen heroes now, and I love seeing all the support from all around the nation. Uh, because of my running, and I love seeing them. I love seeing the support we get every single run. Why do you do this? I just do this to uh, help out people through the darkest time in their life. I don't think any of us should be going through what people are feeling, uh, especially our family. Um, what I like to think of is imagine me losing my dad, my mom, or my, one of my siblings, or just one of my friends. Uh, that's why I do this mission, so everybody who knew the fallen hero I run for know that they will never be forgotten. In Sioux Falls, Carter Schmidt, Kelland News. And we're including links to Running for Heroes website and Facebook page in this story at kelland.com.